Hello Collective, welcome to a general energy reading. So I'm going to go ahead and tap in to see what spirit needs you to know at this time. I hope that everyone enjoyed their new year. Happy 2023. So let's see what spirit needs you to know in this current energy. Spirit, give me some messages for the collective. This is timeless, so whenever you click on the video, that's when the messages could apply. Spirit, give me some messages for the collective. What is the energy? What would you like for the collective to know at this time? What is the energy? Okay. I have forgiveness and understanding. Bottom of the deck. Raise your vibration. Okay. So for some of you, Spirit is asking you to forgive someone. To have... um. A more compassionate energy towards the situation or this is what someone is being asked in regards to you I feel like um your extension your elevation depends on you being able to forgive and move past something let's go ahead and tap in to get into some more energy spirit why is forgiveness and understanding here for the collective what is the message why is forgiveness and understanding here for the collective what is the energy spirit why is forgiveness and understanding here for the collective what is the energy messages for the collective why is forgiveness and understanding here Okay, so I have the Page of Pentacles. For some of you, I'm just getting like something new. There's a new piece of information that's being discovered, that's coming out. Give me some more energy for forgiveness and understanding. Why is forgiveness and understanding here? The Five of Swords. I feel like somebody's in this um, very hateful energy here, Collective. For some of you, this is somebody in this Five of Swords energy when it comes to you. I feel like you came with generosity. I'm also getting like a peace offering as well, but somebody still wants to be in this five of swords. Give me an energy for the page of pentacles. Why is the page of pentacles here for the collective? What is the energy? The ace of swords. So the truth. Somebody's bringing the truth. Give me an energy for the page of pentacles. Why is the page of pentacles here for the collective? What is the energy? Why is the Page of Pentacles here for the collective? What is the energy spirit? The Two of Pentacles. Tell me more about the Ace of Swords. I'm getting like mishandled. I feel like somebody mishandled the truth. Somebody didn't want... A situation to be exposed something that's hidden give me an energy for the ace of swords why is the ace of swords here for the collective what is the energy why is the ace of swords here for the collective what is the message spirit the knight of wands give me another message so for some of you, this has to do with somebody juggling you here. Being in this Knight of Wands energy, being promiscuous. I feel like information is coming out about that. I have the Four of Cups. So the reason why somebody rejected you is because they were a Knight of Wands. Very immature, in and out. This person um liked to deal with multiple people. For some of you, you're discovering the truth as to why a situation didn't work out. This person likes to put people in competition. Give me energy for the Four of Cups. Somebody likes to dominate. Somebody likes to be in control. Why is the Four of Cups here? For the collective, what is the energy spirit? What would you like for the collective to know? Queen of Cups. Tell me more. And the Nine of Swords. So I feel like for some of you, there's somebody that don't want to face the truth 
about rejecting you. Somebody turned their back on you, but it was because they wanted to go and play and have fun. And now they're seeing you in this Queen of Cups energy. Somebody that's nurturing, compassionate, and generous. Um, for some of you, you could be a mother. But I'm definitely getting like heavy mother figure energy. You're very nurturing. And now this person is in the Nine of Swords because they're seeing your truth. They're seeing you for who you are. And they're seeing themselves for who they are. And it's a painful realization. Yes, yeah, like somebody rejected the Queen of Cups. Someone that was sent in to... help balance this person. For some of you, you were sent in to help heal. And somebody just didn't want it. They still wanted to have fun. They just was not taking things seriously. Somebody took a major gamble here. Somebody kept playing with you, pretty much. That's what it's giving me. Somebody just kept playing with you, toying with your emotions. And not really giving you, like, the proper respect, the proper time, effort that they could have. Give me an energy for the Nine of Swords. Why is the Nine of Swords here for the collective? What is the energy spirit? Why is the Nine of Swords here for the collective? What is the message? The Knight of Cups. I feel like for some of you, where this person has rejected you, have hurt you, um, you have an offer coming in. It's almost like um, I'll wash all your tears away. I'll wipe all your tears away. Um, there's somebody coming in to take you out of this Four of Cups. Nine of Swords energy. Somebody's coming in um, being very compassionate and very generous with you. It's like whatever energy that you've been putting out, whatever energy you tried to give this person, that's what's coming back. Your way, collective. Give me an energy for the Two of Pentacles. Why is the Two of Pentacles here for the collective? What is the message? The Six of Wands. Tell me more. It's giving me the energy of somebody being willing to risk it all. Something has to do with um public. Being public. Someone's status, their reputation. The Hermit, somebody being exposed. Why is the Six of Wands here? Why is the Six of Wands here for the Collector? What is the energy? Seven of Swords, somebody's lies are being exposed. I'm hearing like undercover. Somebody has a lot of secrets. For some of you, um, I'm hearing like down low by R. Kelly living a double life. So somebody could literally be living a double life. But this is um, their season to be put on blast for all of their dirty laundry to come out publicly. Give me another energy for the Six of Wands, Two of Cups. For some of you, this person like was lying about being in a partnership, a relationship. Somebody had a secret commitment somewhere else. Give me another energy for the Two of Cups. Why is the Two of Cups here for the collective? What is the energy? The title card. Yeah, for some of you, this person had another commitment um, or either ended up committing to someone else during the course of your interaction and didn't tell you about it for some of you you could have found this out online i'm hearing like devastated i'm just getting the energy of you being devastated by all of this news this caught you by surprise for someone give me an energy for the hermit why is the hermit here for the collective what is the message i have the eight of swords and the ten of cups I feel like somebody's secretly like stuck in a partnership, in a relationship they don't want to be in. For some of you, this person is watching you. So the person that rejected you, wanted to be a knight of wands to you, ended up going into another commitment. They secretly watch you. They feel stuck in whatever this other 
connection is. They're not happy. And whoever they're with is very hateful, very revenge-seeking, could be very spiteful. Give me energy for the Ten of Cups. Why is the Ten of Cups here for the collective? What is the energy? <laughs> Judgment and the Hierophant. Yeah, somebody made a judgment call to get into a commitment, whether this is someone being legally married, moving in together, or just a relationship. Somebody made a judgment call to do this, and now they feel stuck. They secretly feel trapped. Or this is you. Take it as it resonates. Why is the Five of Swords here for the collective? What is the energy? Why is the Five of Swords here for the collective? What is the message spirit? Wow, the world, Leo, Taurus, Scorpio, Aquarius energy. Tell me more about the Five of Swords. The lovers. Somebody has like a hateful lover. I'm hearing Project Pat. I don't know why that's significant, but that's what I'm hearing. Um, Gemini energy on the lovers. Give me a message for the world. I'm hearing like a lover scorned. So for some of you, there's a cycle that's closed out with whoever this five of swords energy is. But this person is scorned and wants revenge. The emperor, yeah. Aries energy on this masculine. For some of you, this could be the father of this person's child or children. I'm hearing now. So for some of you, um, these people did not have a child during the course of your interactions. But once this person made a choice to completely um, separate from you and go into this other relationship, give this person all of the time, the attention, a child came into play. Give me a message for the world i have the star aquarius energy heavy on the major arcana again i'm hearing limelight so something definitely is coming to the forefront something's coming out give me an energy for the emperor i have the sun but it came out in the reverse leo energy for some of you, you could be dealing with somebody that don't provide for their child or children. They don't take care of their responsibilities. But I feel like overall, um, this masculine energy is not happy. Somebody's miserable. Somebody, um, they want to walk away. But again, whoever they're with or whoever they're still tied to in some form... Um, it's very controlling, like likes to tell this person what to do, where to go, what time to be back. And this person is in regret about who they chose to build with. Like they're with somebody who's very controlling, very spiteful. Give me an energy for the star. Why is the star here for the collective? What is the message? Why is the star here for the collective? What is the energy spirit? The two of wands. Somebody is um, upset with themselves because of the direction, the path they chose. Who they chose to invest in. And where it has gotten them. The direction they, were, they headed in. The course they charted. Give me an energy for the lovers. Why is the lovers here? Somebody's very dissatisfied. Wow, the devil. Capricorn energy. Some major arcana. Give me another energy for the lovers. Why is the lovers here? Somebody ended up in, um, I'm getting like a karmic soul tie. Somebody's in a relationship where there's a karmic soul tie to this Five of Swords energy. Um, they're definitely in a karmic contract with this person. Give me an energy for the lovers. Why is the lovers here for the collective? What is the message? Why is the lovers here for the collective? There could also be like substance misuse, a lot of drinking going on. I'm hearing that heavily. I have the Page of Cups. 
Um, I'm hearing like vices. I feel like whoever this five of swords energy is, whoever this karmic is, for some of you, I'm hearing feminine. Um, this is somebody that knows how to keep this person stuck in a very low vibrational energy. And it's because um, he or she knows how to feed this person's demons, like whatever their stronghold is. For some of you, it's drinking like um, this five of swords page of cups energy will provide this um emperor energy whether it's masculine or feminine because it's just energy with um you know drinks like things i'm hearing to keep them intoxicated just things to keep this person um not fully focused on what he or she needs to be focused on kind of removed from reality it's like this um, page of cups would just come and offer this masculine or feminine energy, whatever he or she wants, just to keep them under the influence. Um, and it's, I'm hearing like mind control. It's a control tactic. It's like um, when they engage in these low vibrational activities, this emperor energy gives his power away each and every time to this page of cups. And he or she just keeps feeding this person's um, demons, addictions, just keeps doing it. Don't stop, non-stop, just to keep this person under control. And I feel like that's one of the primary reasons or the primary reason this Five of Swords, Page of Cups energy has so much control when it comes to this dynamic. Give me an energy for the devil. Why is the devil here for... The collective, what is the energy? The Empress. Libra Taurus energy, tell me more. For some of you, they definitely have a kid together. Strength, yeah. For some of you, somebody has like a very controlling mother. So if it's not someone that this person is romantically tied to, it's their mom who's super controlling, who wants to keep this person under their rule, under their thumb, and knows exactly what to say, how to say it to make this masculine energy feel guilty. Give me an energy for the Empress. Heavy on the Leo. Heavy on the Taurus. Give me an energy for the Empress. Why is the Empress here? What's the message? Ace of Cups. Yeah, there's a child here. There's a pregnancy here. I feel like for a lot of you, this person wasted their time dealing with a third party or just multiple people. Somebody spent a lot of time splurging, dealing in some very karmic energy, spending money being consumed by passion but that's the choice somebody made somebody made this decision willingly and now they're in regret about it five of cups somebody regrets it somebody regrets the past somebody has a lot of regrets about the past because in the end they only hurt themselves and that's what they're seeing or that's what they're about to realize give me an energy for the page of cups like they only set themselves back why is the page of cups here the knight of swords you know what for some of you um there's a love offer here that you are fated to receive however whoever this page of cups five of swords energy is this is somebody that is on the prowl this is somebody that wants to rush in before this Ace of Cups could get to you before this love offer could get to you here, collective. They don't want this masculine or feminine energy to move on, to move forward, regardless of how miserable this person is. And I feel like whoever this um, Page of Cups energy is does things out of spite and likes to keep this emperor energy unhappy sad all the time intentionally so that this person don't have the courage to come in and bring you this offer or just to move on with his life in general give me another message for the page of cups why is the page of cups here for the collective what is the message 
Why is the Page of Cups here for the collective? What is the energy spirit? Ten of Swords. Yeah, somebody's bitter here. I, I'm just getting a sense of devastation. Um, this person can't fathom either you or this other energy moving forward. This is a type of person, if they see something online, they would immediately overreact and want to come in and cause some type of confusion. Give me an energy on the Knight of Swords. Why is the Knight of Swords here? Seven of Pentacles. It's like somebody's just waiting. They're just waiting for the moment. As soon as this person feels like this uh, masculine energy is moving on, he or she is going to pounce. They're going to come right in and try to cause some type of destruction. As soon as this person feels as if, you know, you are going to be offered this Ace of Cups or you're moving um, in another direction to offer love to someone else, if this is your energy collective, again, somebody's waiting in the wings. They're waiting for their moment to cause some type of chaos. But it's because this person is bitter. Somebody just don't want to see you move on or see this other person move on. And that's just simple. Give me an energy for forgiveness and understanding. Why is forgiveness and understanding here? The Four of Pentacles. So I feel like, um, I'm hearing like reserved. I feel like you are protecting your energy. You're holding back. Um, you're not fully open to this offer or you won't be. I'm hearing trust and I'm hearing God I trust. Somebody could work in banking. But yeah, I feel like, um... You're putting all your faith in the most high, in spirit. I feel like you um, really don't trust this person. For some of you too, like while you're going through the situation, you may have a hard time even trusting men um, or women in general. But I feel like that's why we have forgiveness and understanding here. It's like, I'm hearing open your heart by Yolanda Adams. Like God does not want you to become jaded by this experience. Give me an energy for raise your vibration. Why is raise your vibration here? What's the message? The Three of Cups. Yeah, I feel like Spirit just really wants you to focus on the lighter side of life. Wants you to go out, have a good time. And not to dwell on the past. Not to dwell on the drama, the negativity. And I feel like the more you just enjoy life, the more um, peaceful you become. That's going to allow you to forgive and develop an understanding of the situation. And it'll allow you to move forward and drop your guard and not be so guarded and you'll be able to manifest exactly what you want. Now, whether or not this person comes in, you know, that depends on this masculine or feminine energy. But there is somebody here that's a blockage. But that's what this person chose. Somebody chose a blockage instead of a blessing. And I might title this reading that. So this is your message. Take what resonates. Stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Stay blessed.